like the universal medical insurance. The measure improves the health condition of the Chinese people and prevents the occurrence of diseases. The basic medical insurance system of China is the largest in the world, in addition to cover the employed urban population. It takes care of the urban unemployed and rural population, effectively safeguarding the health of the Chinese people. In 2017, the average life expectancy of the Chinese people reached 76.4 percent, rising to 40th place globally to becoming one of the fastest ascending countries. The Lancet, an internationally renowned medical journal, has ranked China among the top five countries in the world with the greatest medical advancement, which tributes largely to the country's medical reform. Basically, we have two insurance, workers' insurance and the residence insurance. Workers' insurance is mainly paid by the employer, and the residence insurance are mainly paid by the government. Right now, the target is we are trying to achieve is let individuals out-pocket payment less than 30 percent. Most all governments then ask their population to cover a part of the costs that they, out of their own pocket, WHO suggests a standard um, that uh, cost sharing should not exceed 20 percent.